let's have a quick tour of the Troop dashboard. On the dashboard, you'll find several things. You may have up to five tabs at the top, depending which options your council has enabled. On the dashboard, you'll find a section for your Troop's virtual booth. For more information on setting that up and the functionality of that, please be sure to see the virtual booth recording or read the virtual booth tip sheet. Over here, you will see any virtual booth orders that you have to approve or to deliver for the troop. You'll also see if there are girls in your troop that have any delivery orders that need to be approved or delivery orders that are pending. You can click on that to get details about what girls have changes and deliveries to approve. We'll talk about that in just a second. You also have troop sales, so you'll have the ability to set your troop goal in eBuddy. You'll see how the girls in your troop are doing, and you'll see how your troop's virtual booth is doing in terms of what kind of orders they've had. The rewards end date for your troop is set by the council. However, if, you are, if your council is utilizing rewards and allowing girls to select them, you can change this date to be earlier than your council has set the date if you were going to be unavailable at a certain point, for example. Below, you have how the troop is doing in terms of their sales and marketing. You can see how your sales are going for your troop. You can see which girls are making sales, which are sending emails for marketing, who has set up their site. Below that, you'll find a number of reports. You can get a report of all of the orders that all of the girls have on Digital Cookie by variety, what type of order it is. If you're utilizing the initial order or if your council has an initial order, you could see what cookies have been entered by the Girl Scout in order to enter those in eBuddy. You can see which girls have marked as complete their cookie badges or any requirements on their Cookie Family Entrepreneur pin. And if your council is utilizing the Girl Rewards section, you can see what selections the girls have made in order to, again, easily enter those into eBuddy. So also on your Troop dashboard, you have orders. You can find out more information about this on the module for refunding orders. You have My Troop. This is a great way to see the activity of all of the girls in your troop. You can see if they have their cookie site set up or not. You can see if they have any orders to approve. You can see if they, a parent has turned off girl delivery or turned off a variety of cookies. If you click See Details, you'll get more information that the cookie she has sold, how many of those are online versus offline, who the parent or guardian is, does the parent have delivery turned off or has she left it on, and if so, does she have any varieties that are off, and how many marketing emails has the girl sent. If any girl did have orders to approve, you could click on it and see the details for those orders to approve as well. And if a parent has turned off her site for the year, you would see that here as well. The My Troop orders will give you information on any orders that your troop link for virtual booth have that you need to approve or to deliver. You can click on those to get the details on who's getting those cookies, just like a girl would. There is a tab for booth pickup, and if you check out the booth pickup video, you'll find all the information you need on how to utilize this function. We do hope that you will find the Troop dashboard useful for all of the many things that our wonderful Troop volunteers do that help with a cookie sale.